Hello and welcome to this review of this, the Galleon Fireplaces Stove Fan. This is a device which you put on top of a, a coal burning or wood burning stove to twizzle around its little fan here and blow the air so as to better distribute the heat from the stove around the room. Otherwise the theory is if the stove just sits there all the heat goes up and across the, uh, the roof whereas if you have a fan on top of the stove and it blows the air across it should distribute the heat more evenly. So these are quite a popular device for stoves. However they are also or can be fantastically expensive. This one I picked up precisely because it wasn't. It cost me £40 and I got it from Amazon but you can easily pay £80-£90 for a stove fan and I've even seen them at £150 which is just heading towards the absurd. I didn't want to pay anything like that and I saw this one for 40 thought well that can't be any good but I'm going to take a punt on it and actually I'll tell you now from the outset I'm quite pleased with it. So let me show you around. These things are weird little things. They are electric but you don't plug them in. They generate their own electricity from the heat of the stove. So you pop them on the stove and once it gets hot there's a couple of different metals in here which for some reason I don't fully understand when they get hot generate a tiny tiny amount of electricity it's just enough to drive this little electric motor here which obviously has the fan blades on it and it whooshes around and whooshes the air around. In fact whooshes is probably the wrong word um, because when you put your hand up against it as it's going around. You can barely feel any breeze on it at all. And I've seen reviews on Amazon where people have said, I'm not convinced this thing's actually blowing anything at all. But weirdly, it does seem to work. So either it's just psychological and I think it's getting warmer in the room because I've got the fan on, or it is actually blowing the air around. I don't know, but it feels warmer. So I'm quite happy with it. So it's mostly metal, as you can possibly see. You just pop it on the edge of your stove. Normally they say put it at the back because it needs some cool air coming up towards it which then uh, goes over these vents and for some reason the temperature difference between the, the hot at the bottom and the cool at the top makes this whole electrical effect happen and as I say that drives just enough energy to drive this little electric motor and the fan blades were around. Now you can get different models of these with four blades and six blades and all kinds of contortions and but I don't think you need to go to excess because as I say this one I have now tried for about the last two months on my stove and it works fine. I have seen complaints on Amazon. Some people say well it doesn't start itself going round. You have to give it a little tap to get it going. And I think people are being impatient because every time I have left it without touching it it will start itself going. But it does need for the fire to get pretty hot in order for it to start itself. And I think that's just the natural laws of physics. Inertia says that to start something from rest takes a lot of energy. It's like pushing a shopping trolley. If you start it from rest and push it, it's a lot of effort. Once you've got it going, it's very easy. And in the same way, this thing trying to start itself going is going to require a lot of heat and a lot of energy to start the fan. Once it's gone, fine, it takes very little. And that's why you can give it a little kick to get it going and it'll keep going. But if you wait long enough and the stove gets hot enough, it will fire itself into life. The other critique, as I've already mentioned, is that some people say they just can't feel a breeze. They've even been known to sort of puff a cigarette smoke in front of this thing and the smoke just drifts aimlessly, seemingly unaffected by the fan. I haven't tried that test. I have put my hand in front of it. You can feel a very slight breeze. It is very slight. It's not like having you know, an electric fan that you'd cool yourself down with in summer. The effect of this is very slight, but it does go round. The blade is a curved blade that should be moving the air. And I would absolutely swear that where I'm pointing this gets warmer than it did before. So it works for me. That's all I can say. And it's inexpensive, fairly solidly built. I don't anticipate any problems with it. The only caveat the manufacturers say is that it shouldn't be put on a stove that is greater than 345 degrees centigrade. I have no idea how hot my stove gets. You can get stovepipe thermometers and temperature gauges. I haven't got one but from all the gauges I've looked at 345 would appear to be in the very very hot 
end of things, even for stoves, and I don't think I let my stove get that hot. And certainly I've had no problems so far. Quite what happens if you do heat this up beyond that temperature, I don't know. I don't know if the wires on the electric motor start melting or the motor fries. What I have noticed is that once the fire gets pretty roaring hot, you can almost kind of hear the blades whirring a bit more intensely. Speaking of which, by and large, it's inaudible. It's not strictly inaudible. If you actually shut up and listen, yes, you can hear the fan going round, but it is so quiet as to be, to all intents and purposes, just not worth bothering about. If you, if you strain for it, you can hear it. But if you're talking, if you've got the telly on, even if you're reading a book, you don't notice the noise of this fan going around. It is pretty damn quiet, I have to be honest. And you, you just, after a day, don't notice that it's even going round. So all in all, I'm pleased with this. I'm very pleased I didn't pay 80 or 90 quid for any of the more expensive ones. This at 40 does what I want it to do, seems to be sturdily built, and you can't really ask for more than that. So if you're thinking of getting one, I would commend the Galleon Fireplaces a little stove fan to you. I'm, I'm pleased with it. Hope this was useful. Any questions, drop them into the questions below and I will do my best to answer. Thank you very much for watching. Cheers now. Bye bye.